As I was creating this film uh, in spring of 2024, after around about six months of a, a dark period in my life, I was trying to create something to, to give me a lift. Uh, and um, I came across this poem by Emily Dickinson, which is entitled, A Light Exists in Spring, hence the title of this movie. Emily Dickinson wrote this poem uh, in the year 1864. A light exists in spring beautifully captures the way that spring slowly appears in our consciousness, like a light in the distance. And it's quite amazing to think that the final stanza of Dickinson's poem also seems to acknowledge what we now call uh, the seasonal affective disorder or the sad syndrome. Uh, with the passing of winter, obviously entering into spring, we can grasp at something to enable us to drag us out of the sad syndrome. So I hope you enjoy this uh, film and this music and that you get some type of a lift in your spirit as you enter into the North York Moors. Here is a small section from the poem A Light Exists in Spring, written by Emily Dickinson. A light exists in spring, not present on the year, at any other period, when March is scarcely here. A colour stands abroad on solitary fields that science cannot overtake, but human nature feels. It waits upon the lawn, it shows the furthest tree upon the furthest slope, you know it almost speaks to you. Then as horizons step or noons report away, without a formula of sound it passes, and we stare. A quality of loss, affecting our content, as trade has suddenly encroached upon a sacrament. As it states in the Song of Songs, or the Song of Solomon, as it's known in chapter 2 and verse 11, See, the winter is past, the rains are over and gone, flowers appear on the earth, the season of singing has come, the cooing of doves is heard in our land, and the fig trees form its early fruit. The blossoming vines spread their fragrance. Arise, come, my beautiful one, come with me.